Hi guys, so right, the Sony's against the Bose QC25, right? Um, all right. Now, what it comes down to is uh, now these are the Sony's are obviously a Bluetooth and noise cancelling, right? And they also can be have a wired connection, right? Now, the bows are noise cancelling and wired. Alright, now, the bows probably, uh, bows do have it when it comes to noise cancellation of the Sony. Alright, now remember the bows are like two and a half times the price, depending on where you live. Um, upwards of, you know, 300 euros, where the Sony's, I got these for 109 euros. When it comes to just noise cancellation, uh, definitely the Bose have it. All right, over the Sony. But the problem with the Bose, the Bose noise cancellation is, uh, for me at least, and I have seen other people um, state the same in the reviews, is that uh, it's a very strong sort of suction effect, and it becomes uncomfortable after about an hour, and it certainly does. With my on my head, um, they just do become that a bit uncomfortable after wearing them, say for an hour. But the noise cancellation doesn't work very well. Um, and the other problem with the bows is when you have them off and you you play them, the sound quality is not very good. Okay, sound quality is not good at all. It sound they sound very dull and lifeless. Unless you switch on the noise cancellation, where the sound is very good, and uh, that annoys me. Now with Sony, the when you have the noise cancellation on or off, uh, the sound is just the same. Uh, another advantage with the Bose, I suppose, is uh, to take a standard. Uh, Treble A battery, you know, where the Sony are rechargeable and will take about two hours. All right. So you know, if you own these and you're traveling a lot, very handy to if the battery runs down. The battery lasts about thirty hours. If it runs down, very easy to just go and get one of these batteries and pick them up anywhere. Where uh, with the Sony, they are rechargeable, and uh, if the charge goes down, well, you're gonna have to, you know, you're gonna have to one be able to remember to think of charging them, and two, um, have to try and find somewhere to charge them. But not the end of the world. Um, they're both very similar when it comes to comfort. Very similar memory foam, ear pads, both slightly nicer material, I think. So much the same. Feel very similar on the head. Uh, both feel slightly tighter um, over your head. And handed bows have these, um, they fold up quite compact like that, you know. And the Sony don't fold in. That's as compact as you can make the Sony's, you know. But it's not bad, but those of the old edge there. Um, in terms of weight, there's not much in it. Uh, sound quality, the bows, when they're in, when you have the noise cancellation and the equalizer switched on, it would have the edge over the Sony's, even in wired mode. There's not much in it, if you ask me. Uh, in terms of you know value for money, well, the Sony's hands down. I much prefer the Sony's. I think, it, in fact, I'll, I'll probably sell the bows now. Of the Sony, you know. Uh, that's about it. So thank you for watching.